la 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 I can't believe it. It's been ages. Where have you been? I've, I've been working undercover, sort of, uh, as a Yeti. <laughs> I've been doing writing and stuff, and, well, I sort of changed my name to Shy Yeti. I've got gigs and all sorts going on. Maybe I'm just being paranoid. You know what you must do. Sorry, I've just seen something. There's a, a, a gate. It's usually closed. Someone's bust the log. That's really weird. Hey! What's going on? Stay back. Stay back. Oh. It wasn't a very big robot, I know viewers, but it was still a robot and it still trapped me. Or well, somebody trapped me in that tennis court. Oh, I don't know. This is what I've been talking about. Strange things going on and... It's gone. Well, I know it was little, but... Blimey. I knew it. I knew something was up. I'm going to have to go and seek some advice. I'm going to have to speak to an old friend or two. I have a nasty feeling that the power of Sutton Park is returning. Hello? What, is it time for tea? Is it? Really? Oh, hello. Yeah, it's me again. I'm safe back home, you'll be glad to know. After that strange incident with that robot in the tennis court, I, I know, I know. It's weird how I was kind of saying to you that I was worried that things were going strange again and, and then that! It's just the beginning of things. It does make me think that I need to contact some of my old friends. All this sort of poem writing and stuff, and everyone's got their own lives, you know. Some of some of my old friends have become very, very influential pe people um, in their heads. And I, I just don't know what I can do. I suppose I need to talk to them. You know, if it really, if I am going to get approached by strange monsters and things again, oh dear, they obviously, oh, it's, I make times like this, it makes me think, like, for instance, what would Harry do in this situation? What would he do in this situation? I haven't a clue. I don't know. Gosh. Gosh, is that you, Harry? Uh, well, well, what would you do? I mean, what would you do in a situation where all those old monsters and horribleness was coming back from Southern Park? I mean, what would you do? Have a hobnob. Have a hobnob? And a cup of tea. Just... That is yeah, a just good. Relax. That is a good idea, actually. A hobnob and a cup of tea would be a quite good idea. I suppose it. But, but I, if I was like cornered in a back street by a monster or a claw or, or a skull-faced monstrosity, a hobnob and a cup of tea wouldn't be close at hand. Um, you could say your prayers. Say my prayers. Yes, I could. I could. Yes. It's a thought. I mean, it's just a thought. Yes. It's weird. You see, I'm now I'm hearing voices. If only Harry was here. I just have to take his advice. Use a chocolate hobnob and a cup of tea. Yes, yes. 
Ah, uh, so you are back. What news do you have from London? It would appear that the subject has escaped. What shall we do now? There is no change in plan. He must be eliminated. <laughs> Hello. Hi, yeah. Uh, oh. Well, I've been really concerned about what happened in the park. I mean, as you can understand, the whole thing with that robot. I mean, where did he come from? It's really worrying. Obviously, it was targeting me. You don't just get robots wandering around parks. Well, not often. And it was obviously after me. I, I just. I have a nasty feeling I'm being targeted. As I've said before, I have a nasty feeling that Sutton Park is... The power of Sutton Park is returning. Anyway, I should be safe here. Um, I'm, I'm down in the stores in the archives where I work and I need to make a couple of phone calls. I, I need to warn people if things are going on. I might not be the only person who's targeted. But uh, I just found this <laughs> amongst the, uh, all the books and stuff. I've forgotten this was here. This is the first book I wrote, soon after I sort of went into hiding over Sun Park. <laughs> it looks very, very basic <laughs> compared to how things are now, but uh, still, it rather looks like the way things are going, I'm not going to get much chance of writing in the near future. Careless talk costs, it certainly does in the world of Sutton Park. Don't, 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 Who should I ring first? Oh, what are these? Chili babies. Chili babies. I must have left them down here last time I was working here. <laughs> mm. A bit dusty, but quite tasty. Anyway. Yes. Mm. Who should I ring first? There's so many people I need to warn. I mean, as many of the people that used to appear with me on Sutton Park, um, you know, a lot of them came to nasty ends, but not all of them. Not, it's not just me who's gone back to a normal life. Other people have too. Other people have moved on, but I need to warn them. If Sutton Park's targeting me, they could well target them. There's Nick and Elaine and, well, there, there really is a lot of people I need to warn. Hello, sorry viewers. The, the, the light seems to have gone out. What's going on here? Oh dear. Hey. More jelly babies? Surely not. That's really weird. Oh my goodness. I just realised what this means. Jelly babies. Could it mean Oh goodness? If there are jelly babies here then then maybe jelly monsters. Jelly monsters that work for Sutton Park. Here, in this cupboard.